said, look, I got a, uh, the Bed Bath & Beyond had a sale and I got this uh, foot massager I've had my eye on for over a year. And I'm gonna, oops, unbox it for you uh, with one hand. I love to support China. I think the reason the store is closing is because of China. Um, no more shit, no more shit. Oh, look at this. It comes in an egg carton. It's gonna be wonderful. Look at that. Toss them on the ground. And some plastic here. Unboxing is probably halfway done already. I'm gonna lift this up. Now, if you have small children, so you didn't have a chance to abort, you can just put them in here. Just kidding. Let's see. And by the way, the saleswoman at this Bed Bath and Beyond was a real cunt. She said, by the way, no returns. All sales are final after she rung it up. I said, well, if it's broken, I can return it, right? She said, I seriously doubt if that item is broken. I said, well, I hope you have a fun time getting a new job during a pandemic, bitch. No, I didn't say that, but I thought it afterwards. All right, so I put my feet in, and I'm not going to read the instructions. I'm just going to turn it on. Ooh. Okay, how about turn on the heat? Oh, she's very noisy. She's compressing my feet, you know, like somebody's giving my feet a blowjob. Let's see. Low, medium, high. Let's do high. Medium air. High air. All right, audience, so this is the second cycle. It turns off after like a while. I guess in case you've come too many times. But I've had no less than six female orgasms on this thing. It's really amazing. It's like, it's like getting your feet sucked off by giant um, prostitutes, two at the same time. So, uh, it's like if you had, you know, like two feet, but I can't really describe it. But it's amazing. Okay, it's like you have two feet, and each feet is a dick, and each dick is getting sucked off by a different prostitute at the same time. I guess. It doesn't have to be a prostitute. It could just be, you know, I guess your wife or her sister or husband. I don't know. 